Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. Only a yard on the keeper, and it'll be second down. Well, sometimes you just have to give credit to the defense. Great job there at the point of attack, holding up. They won their battles at the line of scrimmage, left him no space to try and run. A really nice job swarming to the ball carrier. This time, Roethlisberger will throw. Zach Ertz has it complete. And he will reach the eight-yard line before going out. That'll be marked as a 27-yard pickup. But normally you see three tight ends in a formation. You have to think to yourself, this has got to be a run. And I know as a safety, when I saw that, I took an extra step or two towards the line of scrimmage. Instead, they threw the ball, and he found one of those tight ends for a very nice pickup. Play action. It's Roethlisberger. They'll roll him out right. A dump off to Elliott. And he'll be brought down right on the edge of the goal line at about the one-yard line. That was play number seven on this drive, and it got him seven yards. Elliott will score. Touchdown, Packers. So they brought the extra bulk in down on the one-yard line, and they're able to push this one across. Yeah, I can just see your face right now because I know we're mind-melding on this one. Coach Madden would love this. Power football, hat on a hat, chest to chest, driving forward, touchdown. Get over the extra point, and the lead is now 21-14. Touchdown here to kick it away. And this will not be returnable. It's out of the back of the end zone for a touchback. Cleveland offense making their way out. They'll look for a drive to tie this up. Down 21-14 as they have it first and 10. Off play action. Jones. And it's a short one here. Complete to his tight end. Yeah, this will be a gain of five as he gets it to the... shy of the 40 at the 38-yard line. Now it looks like we'll get a timeout, and we will. We've got an injured Packer on the field. Not something you want to see in Week 16 or any week, really. We'll be right back. Now Jones throwing on first down. Let's just break this down and make it pretty simple. Key to the drag route, letting the play develop, finding the hole in the defense, and giving your athlete, yes, athlete, a chance to make something happen once he has the ball in his hands. And this time they were ready for him as they'll stop him right at the line of scrimmage. Officially, it's no gain on the play, and they'll remain a few inches shy of a first with third down looming. runners who understand situations. That was just third and inches. No reason to dance around in the backfield and try and break off a bigger play. Just go pick up the first down, and that's exactly what he did. And this will be taken across midfield and into Green Bay territory. 
They'll call it a gain of four on first, and that'll make it second down. They'll run with a backup. This is Williams. Oh, he's got a little daylight. The 20. And finally out of bounds inside the five at the four. 43 yards on the ground for him so far. Trailing here in the third, and that run might just be the spark that this offense needs. And don't you just get the sense that he's going around, not just in the huddle, but looking over at the bench and saying, ball, give me the ball. Let me carry this thing home. And he'll get blown up behind the line of scrimmage. Back at the six. That's going to wind up a loss of a full three yards on first down. Second down and goal. Jones, touchdown, Browns. Ian Thomas from six yards away. And the Browns are an extra point away from tying this ball game here in the final moments of the third quarter. It's been quite the game for him individually. A trio of touchdown catches now. So pick a route, any route, whatever you want him to run, he's going to do it and do it well and end up in the end zone. This has really been fun to watch. And they'll start this drive just across the 30. Pretty nice work on the return. And as this offense makes their way back out, NFC playoff race time, we give you a look at what's going on there. And you can see they're in second place in the division, but they have clinched postseason football. That's the important. And that's caught inside the 35. And all the way down to the 29. They go play action with Roethlisberger. Flush to his right. And this is caught. It's Brown. And finally, down he goes as they work it inside the 10 to the 7. Back to back receptions for him, and it's another first down. Now Roethlisberger. Forced out to his left. And he will get this into the end zone. Touchdown, Green Bay. Ben Roethlisberger taking it in from seven yards away. And the Packers answer back with a touchdown of their own to break our tie and take the lead here in the fourth. Extra point try, good by Godot. And they will take the seven-point lead. Scoring summary, three-play drive. And in the end, it's capped off by a seven-yard run. Gano now following the touchdown here to kick it away. And here comes a return from just beyond the goal line. And they'll get him down right at the 25-yard line, so the same result had he opted for the touchback. Ready to take over again on offense. Out comes Cleveland. And now, after the touchdown a moment ago, they work from behind in a seven-point game in this fourth quarter. Plenty of time on the clock. Packer pressure, and down he goes. And Dominican Sue. What a play by him. That's going to go as a loss of 13. Boy, that's tough, Charles. First play of the drive, you're hoping to stay ahead of schedule. You take that huge sack, and now you're facing second and a mile. And the entire time, you're probably thinking the same thing I was. Either get rid of the ball. And a hit in the ball is jarred free. And the Packers you pick it up. Number, Give us and he lost the football. So it goes as a fumble, but the key thing, not a fumble loss. Yeah, that, that stat's big, isn't it? I mean, I remember watching teams play. The ball might be on the ground a number of times during the game, but the other team doesn't get it. That's a huge difference in the ball game. And in this case, they were able to retain possession.